Welcome one and all to the demo for Little Known Galaxy. My name is Deep Space Matt, and today I'm the captain of my very own spaceship. That's seen better days. If I want to make this the best cozy home in the cosmos, I'll need to clear out the clutter, plant crops for food, befriend the crew, and go on planetary away missions for resources. But can I uncover the secrets of a mysterious alien relic? Let's find out in Little Known Galaxy. All right, here we go with the demo for Little Known Galaxy. This is an upcoming cozy life sim, but instead of being in a town or a village, I'm going to be the captain of my very own spaceship exploring the cosmos. Now, as of this recording, this demo is available for you to download and try for yourself. If you want to check it on out, I'll have a link in the description down below where you can do just that. But for now, let's get right into it with a new game. In the near future, humans have traveled into the universe. Starships have expanded our horizons and have brought friendships to new galaxies. As a new captain in training, you have just been given your first assignment. To join a rundown starship orbiting a desolate gray planet. Your mission is to discover the secrets behind a mysterious relic hidden on the planet's surface. If it's hidden, how do I know about it? But with the ship falling apart and no clues left to investigate, the crew has lost hope of ever solving the mystery. It's up to you now, Captain. Remember to support your crew, follow your heart, and always take care of each other. Oh, hello. Hey there. I'm CPU, the handy dandy and charismatic central processing unit aboard this very ship. And what is your name? Uh, my name is Captain. No, it's, uh, my name is Matt. Are you happy with this name? Generally, yes I am. Welcome aboard, Matt. What a great name. Don't be offended if I forget, though. I am just terrible at remembering names. You and me both. Oh, this ship has a name too. What was it again? Um, sh shippy make ship face. Uh, doesn't sound right. Well, hey, let's just rename the ship together right now. Oh, okay. Well, shippy make ship face is indeed good, but we're gonna go with the with the Colossus. Yep, sounds good. Oh yeah, Colossus. Now that's the name for a spaceship, all right. It's going straight into the database. Also, I should store what you look like into my image files. I don't want to confuse you with other people or furniture aboard. Alright, what do we got here? Freshen up your appearance. Skin tone. Oh, we can go, oh, we can go purple. The light blue. Though, the light blue? I think I'm going with that. Uh, hairstyle. How many hairstyles do we have? Can we go around the world? We can. What is a captain's hairstyle? Uh, well, well, there's a captain's hairstyle. Um, that one's not bad. Uh, yeah, I think I like that one. Where was it? Uh, here? Was this it? Wait a minute. No, it was, it was this one. Alright, hair color. Uh, we're gonna go with the jet white facial hair. Oh, the handlebar. Uh, do we want? Yeah, we want some facial hair. Let's go with uh, just a full-on beard here. And then hair color. We're gonna match our hair. Is that one matching, or is that too gray? Uh, wait a minute, where, okay, hair color is 11, so this should be 11. Yeah, wait a minute, what, what, what's going on here? We're skipping numbers, 6 to 8 to 10, to 11, 15, 19. Okay, uh, accessory. Oh, look, <laughs> look at us. Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, we're going with that one, for sure. Oh, we got the Vulcan ears. No, we got the, uh, LaForge visor going on. Hat? I don't want to cover up this hair. 
Yeah, no hat. Uh, I, well, eye color doesn't really matter when we got the visor on. Shirt color. Do we go uh, command red or command gold? Let's go command gold. Pant color black. Uh, is that black? That's the darkest. Yes. So we'll go with that one. Shoe color black is great. There we are. We look great. Yes. Apply these changes. Looking great. Why, thank you. Okay, let me show you around the ship now, Matt. Oh, here we are. Ta-da! Wait, this is a rundown ship? It doesn't look that rundown. Look at you. You are gigantic. Holy cow. Look at the giant plug as well. Welcome to the bridge. I mean, it looks great. It doesn't look rundown at all. This is just one of many deck levels on the ship. You can access a map of the ship from your space pack if you find yourself lost at any time. Here is the command center, including your very own captain's chair. You can use your chair to navigate us to new destinations in space or check our travel progress when we're in route. Also, it's super duper comfy too. Only the best Corinthian leather. This is the elevator which you can take quickly to different deck levels on the ship. There's a deck for science and medical, crew quarters, recreation, cargo and shuttle bay, and engine room. There's also a central plaza deck where a lot of the crew get together and shop. Let's go check out the plaza now before the crew get started with their day. We got like a whole shopping center on the ship as well, our very own promenade. Welcome to the plaza deck, the heart of our crew community. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh, that one does... that store doesn't look so good down there. Here, Robert runs the general store for purchasing supplies and most things you'll need to keep this ship in ship shape. Oh, that's right. Robert is expecting you, too. He wanted to give you some data on buying and selling items. But that can wait. On with the tour. Oh, is this the, uh, the food station, the cantina? Oh, they got the game playing on the TV as well. This is Chip's Canteen in case you need a bite to eat or want to hang with the crew. Chip should be here soon to open the register and get things cooking. I hear the food is great, but last time I tried it, Stuart had to recircuit my processors. Since then, he said I'm not allowed to join in anymore. But moving on, let's head down to the cargo and shuttle bay next. So this is deck four. This is deck six. Here we are in the cargo hold. Oh, somebody lost their basketball on top of the uh, the back the backboard there. Edward is our chief mechanic and runs the machine shop. It's a great place for upgrading your tools and buying mechanical things. You can also help with larger upgrades to the ship when you want to make improvements. Uh, where's the where's our shuttle? The shuttle bay is just to the right where your shuttle craft is docked. Your shuttle craft can take you down to any planet's surface when we are in orbit. I think you're getting the sense of things, so let's head to your deck now. Oh my. Oh, this is mine? What happened here? Holy cow. Well, here's the rundown section. This is your very own captain's deck. It is located on the top of the ship next to the bridge. Um, well, I guess it's a bit of a mess right now. This is just a lot of general wear and tear we are looking at here. General wear and tear? This looks like a lot more than that. We haven't had a captain stick around for a while, so things here have seen better days. Anywho, now that you are here, you'll have to spruce it up a bit. And last but not least, why don't we head into your new quarters? What about medical? Welcome home. What do you think? It's, uh, it's nice and clean. Better than what we just saw. You noticed, I even had fresh sheets put on the bed. Well, go ahead and get unpacked and check out your new digs. And just pop out of your quarters when you're ready to start the fun. Alright, so do we... Oh. Oh, here we go. Okay, WSD to move around. We got five out of four power. We got so much power right now. Fuel supply, energy, and health. It is Sunday, 7 a.m., space pack our missions visit the general store located on the plaza deck for an introduction what is this space alliance captain assignment 
Matt, we hope CPU has done a good job introducing you to your new surroundings. As you know, your assignment is to support your new community, repair your ship, and unlock the secrets of the mysterious relic. Supplying food and resources to generate income and to provide your personal quarters as well as the ship's community will be ne necessary. Life out in deep space can be a change of pace for some. Good luck. And welcome aboard from Piper. Welcome aboard, Captain. It is with great pleasure that the entire crew welcomes you into our ship's community starting today. We are so happy to have you join our ship and hope you feel like it will become our home as well, your home as well. Thank you for joining our team and family from your crew. What happened to the other captains? Why did they not stick around for a long time? I have a, a chest here. I have a floor lamp. Let's grab that. And recycled parts are reused in all kinds of machinery and ship repairs. Recycling is important. Oh, we have different. Oh, we have different. Oh, we can change the color. Oh, very nice. Uh, we're going to go with a nice orange there. Oh, look at that. And this floor lamp, we got a desk lamp there. Oh, what happened to our plant? Not doing so well. Okay, uh, shift puts you in walk mode. Can I take, can I water this plant? What is this? Oh, the decorator. Hey, look at this. Okay, we only have two options. Do I like the... The stark white? I do not like the stark white. No. Floor texture. Yeah, I guess we're just saving things exactly how they were. Wait a minute. What? Is this paintbrush? Can I do something with this? No, I can't. And is this like a doggy door? There's like a paw print on it. Alright, uh, let us head out. We've wasted an hour in our room. Matt, I hope you're settled in and ready to get started. I know your deck has seen better days, so I thought you could use this. Handy Restoration Ray. Excellent. This tool can be used to clean up small damaged areas quickly. To use it, press left mouse button and hold. Using tools takes energy, so keep an eye on your energy bar, E, and don't overexert yourself in one day. Give it a try for yourself. You can let me know if you have any luck. When you're done in here, head to the bridge next to meet our science, our senior science officer. She's been eager to meet with you too. Fixer upper, your captain's deck is looking rough. Use the restoration ray to clean up 10 holes or garbage piles, then inform CPU of the progress. All right, uh, let's get these holes. Like holes fixed up sounds like it should be fairly important. Can I do this hole? Oh, I need to upgrade for that big old hole there. All right. Oh, and we got uh, some hardware parts. Sound great. Oh, this slows you down. Am I not close enough? There we go. Oh, what do I get here? Dark matter. Hello. Planter does not accept this item. Oh, we have little planters. Excellent. Okay, now it said... Okay, 4 out of 10. Yeah, holes are garbage piles, but it looked like uh, this pile of dark matter counted as well. So you know what? We're just going to clean up this uh, this pathway here. Can I get rid of this? Or do I need an upgrade? I need an upgrade. I like how it sparkles when you clean it. Oh man, hopefully I can get like an upgrade to the range of this. And what is that over there on the left? We get some water as well. Oh, I'm sure for our plants. Whenever we get like a... Uh... Oh, is that not hitting it? There we go. Oh, I can go to this small one. Excellent. Alright, how are we looking here? Oh, we did it. We got it. Uh, inform C How do I inform CPU? CPU? I have done... How do I, how do I inform you? Calendar crew. Oh, look at everybody. Everybody's a stranger. Whoa, I... I-1900. The pilot? Look at Sprout? You got some aliens? Uh, can I talk to you? I, I've completed your task. Here's the map. Oh, this leads to the outer hall. Okay, well, we gotta go to the bridge. Hopefully we have a way to run as well later on.
Hello, Captain. I'm Kata, Chief Science Officer and your second in command. I'm so glad you're finally here because I could really use your help. You see, things on board are getting a little out of control. Progress with our mission is not going very well and the ship has been falling apart more and more every day. We even had to close some areas of the ship for safety reasons. The crew has been losing patience and are starting to believe things will only get worse. As the second in command, I have been staying motivated but it's getting harder to inspire others. Why don't you go introduce yourself to the crew and see what you can make of everything. You can find details on the crew in your crew tab when you're ready. Come and find me once you've had a chance to meet everyone. Okay, we gotta go say hi to everybody. Thanks, Captain. Talk to you soon. Okay, is anybody here on the bridge? Like the pilot, maybe? Uh, no, nobody's here. I can talk to the CPU, presumably. Great job fixing up your deck so far. To restore areas that are too large for the restoration rate, check in with Edward in the machine shop. Hey, and I got some money for that. Let's go. And 10 recycled parts. Is it the general store for an introduction? Uh, where are we going here? The plaza. Oh, I like the little elevator going down like that. Okay, there's Chip. But let's talk to Edward first. Actually, let's talk to this person because I don't know where they... Oh, okay, they're going in there. That's fine. Hello. Captain, welcome to Colossus's general store. My name is Robert. My son Jimmy and I are in charge of the supplies here. We carry many items for purchase that can be bought with ship credits. I can also find off-ship buyers for anything you produce or want to sell. Just bring me your items when I'm at the register. Oh, and that also reminds me... Jimmy! Where is that boy? Well, wait, I remember how to do it myself. Click automatic door opening sound over there on the left? On the right? Oh, hello. This here is Binbot. I will send him to your deck each day to collect anything you want to sell there as well. <laughs> Beep Boop, here to help. Just put any items you want to sell into Binbot and he will bring them to me every evening. Feel free to shop around before you leave. I'm looking forward to a prosperous working relationship. Indeed. Uh, oh, hello, I-1900. I-1900 here, programmed assistant for the family unit. Scanning? You are not programmed into my directory. Scanning again? Your facial scan and fingerprints will be stored as guest user. Thank you for stopping by. Okay, so, uh... We got two out of the 18. Anybody back here? Can I go through? I can. Okay, look at my map. You'll need an access card to get into Jimmy's room. Fair enough. What is this thing? Oh, no, I don't I don't need to restore that to get into Robert's room. This is shiny here. This is sparkling. How about this? 3D bot, welcome to 3D printing services looking to fabricate some new items. Oh, wow. Not just yet. Don't have the money. Abstract lamps. CPU plush doll. Oh, a bunch of new wall textures. There we go. I like how the floor the floor textures, hold on. Are all various shades of gray. And we got what is this? Plant material. Oh no, I don't want nope, nope, nope. I was just taking a look. A battery and fertilizer oh wait, wait, there's somebody here to talk to I didn't even notice you hello Lynn hi captain being the botanist aboard a starship means a lot more than just research so I'll be helping to produce food resources for the ship throughout the journey even planets like the gray planet can provide valuable resources we need to grow crops so don't discount the items you find down there just yet oh more people excellent yes everybody come here so I don't have to go find you. Oh, it's Jimmy. What now? Oh, sorry, I thought you were someone else. So you're the new captain. Well, you don't look like the other captains, but you'll have to work as hard as me to gain everyone's trust. 
I suppose we'll be heading down to the Great Planet soon. Sounds kind of exciting, but I'll be stuck here if you need me. Alright, and then we had... Oh, hello! Greetings, Matt. My real name is tough for humans to pronounce, so everyone just calls me Pilot. As the nickname suggests, I'm Colossus's navigation officer. I require little rest so you can find me here at the helm most of the time. Here? For our mission, we are orbiting the elusive Gray Planet. CPU and I monitor all progress on the surface from the bridge. Are you really a captain? Yes, I am. Wow, that's cool. You don't believe in ghosts, do you? Uh, I mean, out here in space, who knows what's going on? Sure, I believe. Really? This ship makes some creaking noises at night, but I'm too afraid to get up and see what it is. My grandpa says it's because this ship is so old and needs some repairs, but he's old and he doesn't make creaking noises. Alright, let's go uh, in here. Oh, there's some. there's like a cat statue down there. Hello. Hi there, I'm so happy we finally have a new captain. I'm Lauren, and I help keep people in shape around here. Rock climbing, weights, yoga, a little bit of everything for everyone. We used to have some cool programs in the Hollow Sim too, but that broke a long time ago. Actually, it's been a while since anyone has really bothered fixing anything up around here. Sometimes my brother struts around and acts like he's captain, but you seem more capable. Oh, my brother? Yeah, good luck with him. Who's Wait, who's your brother, though? And shouldn't the chief engineer be fixing stuff? Can I, like, climb on this? Intermediate climbing routes, 510A, 511B. Can I not go on it? I want to climb. Beginning, there we go, that's, that's me. Oh, it's got, like, a XYZ up there. That's great. Alright, uh, these shops are all closed. Where does... What does this lead to? Stairs? Well, hold on. Let's go talk to Chip. Oh, watch out. Oh, no. I don't want to do that. Hey, you must be the young new captain I've heard so much about. Well, welcome aboard, partner. I'm Chip, the ship's chef, and I'm usually serving things up at the canteen for the rest of the crew. My wife, Kata, is so relieved you are here, too. She's been working so hard, I barely get to see her anymore. Hopefully, you can help make some improvements around here so she can slow down a little. Alright, let's go... Oh, this shop is closed as well. Let's go take a look where the stairs lead to. Oh, hello. Oh, it's just... If we don't want to take the elevator... Oh, is this like the living quarters? Where am I at? Yeah, crew quarters... Kaida, Chip, and Fiji's quarters. Where is everybody? Uh, Doc 12. Is this where you're at currently? Like, is Fiji here? Oh, you are. Oh, no, that's just your housing location. You're green, this one? Uh, you are not here, presumably. Doesn't look like it. Oh, look at the big old charging port for uh, the robot. All right, let's take the elevator this time. And just to double check. Yeah, that one, this one is your abode. Uh, science and medical. Hello, Doc. You must be the new captain we have been expecting for a while now. I am the junior medical officer and will be tracking your medical records throughout our journey. I do not have any additional data on your assigned mission. Are you a robot? Goodbye. I think you're a robot, Doc 12. Anybody in here? Oh, hello. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new captain, of course. I'm Francis, chief medical officer. You can come see me in the clinic anytime you need help. My daughter is also a junior medical officer on board. She's around here somewhere. Oh, and be careful down on the Great Planet. I swear the last captain was reckless on purpose just so he could get reassigned to a fancier post. Okay, anybody uh, anybody back here? No. Uh, what is up here? Oh, uh, 
your quarters. Oh wait, there's somebody over here taking the, in the sights of the great planet. Well, aren't you a sturdy young thing? Nice to meet you, Matt. I'm Piper. I've been aboard this ship for many years, many years, and my family knows the ins and outs. This ship might be old, but they don't make them like they like this anymore. She just needs someone to give her a little attention. Maybe one day things will get better around here. What are these shiny things? Oh, for scrap metal. Oh, one over here. Two hardware parts. Free stuff. Let's go. It looks like a, a lab of some sort. Oh, careful. Zero G. <laughs> Anybody home? Yes. Oh, two of yous. Oh, it's Kaida. Yes, I already talked to you. Open the quest tab. Use the map can also help you locate the living quarters of someone you were looking for. Oh, no. There we go. Hey, Captain, I'm Sprout. Wow, you're a lot taller than I imagined. I bet you are popular. Do you know over 65% of all trainee captains drop out of the program within their first year? Since my arrival on this ship, we've had a 100% dropout rate, which is statistically impressive. Oh, not that you would... I mean, you look very capable. Uh, shoot. There goes my first impression. Don't worry about it. Alright, uh, how many people we got left to go? Six more people. Edward, Fiji, Max, Shinji, Steven, and Stuart. Let's see if we can go find out where they're at. Since they're not necessarily in their quarters. Plaza, let's go recreation. Uh, anybody here? Oh yeah, look at, oh look at you. We're doing some LARPing down here. I roll. So, new captain, huh? I bet you don't know the first thing about this ship's inner workings or how to fix any of the components around here. This is exactly why everything is so run down. Newbie captains who don't want to take care of an older ship. Just leave it all to me as usual. What a joke. I mean, they've been leaving it to you and you haven't been doing a great job. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Well, hello, Matt. It is lovely to make your acquaintance. Oh, you're an education android. I am mechanical android number 10, but everyone calls me Max. I am also the designated educational instructor and run our school program. I am not directly involved in your primary mission, but I can be a useful source of statistical and analytical data. You can stop by the classroom if you would like to learn something. Very nice. I would like to grab this free stuff. Oh, free money? People just dropping money on the ground. It's like a greenhouse? Uh, nobody home. Uh, anybody here? No. Uh, free stuff. I'm just picking up stuff off. I'm pretty sure that's somebody's money. I'm just taking it off the ground. You need an access card to get into Max's room. Fair enough. All right. Oh, there's more sparklies everywhere. I can't be going around picking all these up. I gotta go say hi to everybody. What is this? Like security? Uh, nobody here. What is this? Uh, oh, quarters. They got all the cameras outside there. Uh, cargo and shuttle bay. What do we got? The machine shop. Uh, hello. I'm looking for Edward. Construction bot is waiting for its next assignment. The register is currently closed. Anybody, anybody here? Let's go take a look at the shuttle. Oh, there's shinies like everywhere. Oh, 
Oh, we got a fancy looking shuttle. Look at that thing. Shinji, hey, I'm Shinji, but I'm not really part of the crew. My family paid for my room and board, so I'm just studying remotely. No offense, but I wish they would have picked a less rundown ship. I mean, how old is this ship anyways? I'll catch you around, Matt. Oh, is that your... Is that your ship? This is our ship? Oh, can I put on a space suit? Human sizes only. It looks like we have areas where we can dock other ships as well. Shuttle bay. Cargo hold. Let's take the stairs down. Grab whatever this is. And see who's here. This machine only takes dark matter fuel. Uh, nobody's here. Okay. Who are we missing? We're missing Edward. It is 7.15 p.m., so maybe people are home. Is that what it is? It's gotten too late in the day. Scanning. Access denied. Real captains only. No trainees. Hey, now. What is this giant exposed reactor core down here? With all the, the liquid? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is there an elevator here? There's got to be an elevator here. Uh, good evening, Captain. Captain, sorry for the intrusion, but it's 8 p.m. I forgot to tell you that every day at 8 p.m. we enter a night mode on the ship to mimic a daylight cycle for the crew and to save power. I'll let you know when it's officially lights out later, though. Bye-bye till then. All right, crew quarters. Uh, who is... Edward, you're green, you're... Wait, you're this one as well? You're... Nobody's here. Okay, is there a way to find out exactly where you are? Oh, wait. No, I already talked to you. I'm looking for Edward, Fiji, and Steven. Where's, uh, Steven? Machinist. Cargo and shuttle bay is where you reside. Okay, maybe everybody's at the plaza. Okay, indeed. Oh, I don't know what anybody looks like, though. Did I already talk to everybody here? Okay, Edward looks like that. Fiji looks like that. And Steven uh, looks like that. Which is none of yous here. And just to make sure... Yeah, I wish it showed me on the map where everybody was at. Or at least showed me here where they currently were. Oh, there. Steven. Oi, oi, oi. I gotta talk to yous. Hey, I'm Steven. I live aboard with my grandparents and little sister, Kendall. If you meet her, try not to mention anything about ghosts. Uh, a little, a little late about that. She acts tough, but I think she's a little shaken up these days. It's not her fault, though. Things have felt creepy and isolating since we arrived at the Gray Planet. Oh, man, what's down on the Gray Planet? Digital bulletin. Nothing new. Oh, wait. No, I already met you. Yeah, you're Robert. I'm glad you found me. Running the general store on the ship keeps me busy here most days. Oh, and I carry a lot of supplies and seeds that could help with your duties around here. Just saying, a rundown ship and a hungry crew is not great for business. Indeed. Uh, I don't know where anybody's at. Recreation? I don't think so. It's all it's all closed down down here. Oh, what time is it? Nine o'clock. Okay, maybe maybe people have gone home by now. So wait, hold on. It was 
EG in the crew quarters. Wait a minute, are all the crew quarters the same? Or does, is that the actual house? I can't tell. Somebody else give me a crew quarter location. Uh, no, that's recreation. I don't know if it's exactly this house or if this is just the house it shows on all the crew quarters. Uh, no, it is this house. Hello. Hey, Matt, I'm Edward, and you can usually find me tinkering in the machine shop. You can probably tell things around the ship have seen better days. But if I had a little help gathering supplies, I know we could really help make, really make a lot of improvements. I know you'll also have your hands full with that gray planet. I haven't been down myself, but from what Kata says, is pretty barren. The last two, or was it three captains, that Space Alliance assigned to our ship, it didn't really show much interest in helping out around here. So I'm hoping you might be different. Oh, indeed. Okay, so now we just need Fiji, who obviously isn't in this particular house, I'm presuming. And maybe... Wait, who's, who's, whose room is this? Who's this? Uh, no, that's Kendall's room. This room is locked. Oh, is, are they all locked? Did I miss my chance? I think I missed my chance. It's after 10 o'clock now. Uh, nobody here. Locked. Uh, oh, this is Fiji's room here. Okay, so yeah, indeed. So when it says, says on here... This is the location. It's not that particular house. It's just in the crew quarters. Let's grab this. So where is Fiji now? And what is she? Do I have any information about her? Stranger. No, like I don't know where she like works or anything like that. All right, well, let's go back up here. And I guess we try tomorrow. Oh, look at the CPU is already asleep. Yeah, it's 11 at night. We need to go to sleep. This will save your game, indeed. We did absolutely nothing, which is a-okay. Just our first day. Day two, Monday. Oh, we have a new uh, message. Good morning, simulating day mode. Dear valued customers, just a reminder that space pack upgrades are still available at our shop. We can add more inventory slots to your space pack today. Stop on by for details and pricing. All sales final. Okay, no, 7 a.m., we're headed straight. Oh. What is this? Hello. Uh, Ling, I think? Or Lin. Hi, Captain. I have been looking forward to meeting with you up here on the captain's deck. As the botanist and agricultural specialist on board, I've been growing the bulk of the ship's food crops. To be honest, it's a big task, but with your help, I think we can do it together. Do you think you'd make a good spaceship farmer? Absolutely. Yes. Oh, thank you so much. Well, to produce anything, you will first need to build machines. Machines and decorations can be crafted on your workbench. There are indoor machines like planters that will be marked with an indoor icon, and outer hull machines like solar panels that will be marked with an outer hull icon. These types of machines must be built on the outer hull. Here is a basic planter. But planters and machines won't work without power. You will see the power icon flash when it needs power. Let's head to the outer hall and I'll show you how to generate power. Oh, look at us in our little space, shoot, space suits. To generate more power, just build another solar panel to collect all the solar energy around us. Oh, there's the gray planet. The ship's HUD 
Power display will also help you keep track of how much power you're generating and how much power your machines are requesting. Here you can have this solar panel to get you started. Excellent. Let's head back inside and I'll tell you more about plants. Now that your planter is powered, just press left mouse button on it while holding some seeds. See how easy it is? You can have the rest of the potato seeds I harvested this morning. Excellent. Planted seeds will need to be watered every day until they are ready for picking. See the difference between a watered plant and a dry plant? This is the watering pack I usually use. There we go. You can get new seed types from Robert in the general store. Also, any extra crops you grow can be sold to gain credits as well. Bring me some of your potatoes when they are ready and I'll know you have the hang of things. And thank you, Captain. It's nice to have you on board. No worries. Let's get to farming. Space farming. Solar panel, small data on the workbench. Oh, there's the little bin bot. Okay, so I have potato seeds. Uh, can I pick these up and move them? What is this? I don't, I'm right clicking. I don't know what that's doing. Oh, oh, yes. There, put that there. Uh, actually, maybe I want them all in like a row. Let's do that. I'm going to replant. Don't worry. Do these stack? They do not stack. Uh, wait, did I lose? Oh, no, there's seeds. I thought I lost a seed there. We're good. Uh, but this needs power, so we need to get a solar panel. Do I have to walk all the way out there? What is this? Oh, the decorator for... Oh, look at that. Very nice. Yeah, it does nothing in here, right? This machine can only be built on the outer hall. Head outside to the outer hall. Do I need to put on a space suit or will it automatically do it for me? Do you want to suit up and visit the outer hall? Yes. Oh, this place has seen better days as well. Okay, we got uh, a panel here. Oh, we got free stuff. Alright, let us take this. We'll just put it right next to this one. There we go. Excellent. What, is, what does this give us? Was that dark matter? <laughs> or hardware parts? Okay. I'll grab this. Head back down. Uh, yep, go back inside. And let us water these. Can I, like, do multiple at a time? No, one at a time. Excellent. And do I need to, like, refill this at the water station here? I Maybe? There's no meter. Okay, it is now 11 a.m. We gotta go find out where Fiji is. Oh, we gotta do this, though. We got an exclamation point. Oh, solar panel. That's fine. You do not have the materials. We need 40 scrap metal. A furnace smelts ore, stone, or other resources for ion electrolysis. Or with ion electrolysis. Recycler, compost machine, more planters, another storage bin. Okay, so we'll have to clean up more in order to uh, to get the needed parts. Let's grab this, whatever this is over here. Oh, and there's one over here as well. And I guess we find, we go look for Fiji. Uh, I have no clue where she would be. 
let's check her her quarters first. Uh, nope. Uh, plaza? Yeah, it'd be helpful if... If it stated what their job... Wait, what does... Oh, it does state what your job is, right? Oh, it just says crew member. That does not help me. You could be anywhere, crew member. Are you in the store? Excuse me, Jimmy. Uh, no. Are you over here? In the gym? Uh, no. Uh, oh, hello. I already talked to you. Uh, recreation? No, there's Lynn. Are you over here gardening? Uh, no. Over here, this is like the school. I don't think you're here. Man, where could you be? Oh, no, I don't need to water the ground. Maybe the cargo room? Uh, no. More sparklies over there. Let's go check the... The shuttle bay. Uh, no. Oh, man, I'm running around this entire ship. We're gonna spend the entire day doing this. Engine room. Watch, we passed each other on the elevator somewhere. Uh, not in the engine room. Nobody's in the engine room. Nobody's ever in the engine room. Science and medical. I think we've checked all the other floors. Uh, no. Hey, 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 Kaida? Yes, I know. I'm having trouble finding somebody. Oh, look at the living quarters. Yeah, I don't need to know the living quarters. I need to know where they are right now. I mean, I can't, like, ring the doorbell. Where is this person? We're running around everywhere. I feel like I'm missing something. Or maybe, like, I went into a building and she was there, but I couldn't... You know, like that, where it's kind of hard to tell that it's actually a person. Uh, you're not working back here, are you? Oh, can I get... Oh, I can't get back there. Or maybe you were... I, you could have been, like, walking up and, or down the stairs or something. You're not over in this little park area, are you? No... You weren't here shopping and I missed you. Shopping? No, you're back there cleaning. Nobody else in here. No. I definitely feel like I'm I'm missing something here. So the map definitely doesn't show me where people are. Private entrance. Oh wait, Fiji's quarters here. This is private entrance, so the middle. Maybe you're in there. Oh, there you are. Oh my goodness, I've been looking all over for you. Well, hello there, I am Fiji. I'm getting good vibes from you. You have a kind soul. This ship has been giving off strange vibes, so I've been meditating to try and speak with the unsettled spirits. Maybe if we all work together, the Great Planet will reveal her mystery to us. I mean, you know, sometimes 
it's a good thing and sometimes you get into a dead space situation where you don't want to find out what the mystery is okay uh where was oh, i don't remember was it science and medical where kato was last but she's probably not here now nope she's gone she was like here is she on the bridge so we are we're done with this use the planter and seeds to grow the crops that'll take a few days return to kata oh there you are great job captain i'm glad to see you have met everyone Remember to check in with your crew often. They may need help or can offer you advice from time to time, too. In fact, I think Edward just mentioned that your shuttlecraft should be up and running now. You can use it to travel down to the Great Planet and start investigating the relic. I've been researching the elements on the surface to see if I can make any scientific connections. So far, though, I haven't picked up on anything significant. But before you head down, let me give you some tools to take with you. This shovel is useful to dig up sandy areas on the surface. Excellent. And take this laser blaster to break up rocks or defend yourself from any aggressive critters you may run into. I'm going to stay on board and continue my research in the lab. Head to the shuttle bay when you're ready and Edward will meet you there. Oh, I'm ready. Good luck, Matt. Let's go. I got a laser blaster. I got a shovel. I do really like the pixel art. It looks great. And I'll get those shinies eventually. Hello? Hey Matt, over here. I wanted to welcome you to the shuttle bay. This is your personal shuttlecraft right here. Feel free to take her down to a planet's surface whenever we are in orbit. Going down and gathering materials found on the surface is a necessary part of our community, so you'll probably be doing it a lot. These new fangled shuttle models sure look spiffy, don't they? I mean, the red one looked nice. Oh, hello. Oh my. She packs quite a punch, huh? Yeah, better get, better get on board. You see an off switch. I mean, right by the exhaust. There we go. Purrs like a kitten, doesn't it? Anyhow, the Great Planet is waiting for you when you feel like exploring. That relic down there is a real mystery so far and has Kata completely stumped. Good luck and smooth sailing, Captain. Let's go. Grey Planet, the relic. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that relic. There are floating rocks and everything. Perfect landing. I have no away team with me. The gray planet. What is this? Free stuff, though. A Space Alliance mobile research pod, standard issued for on-site testing needs. Oh, nope, don't want to do that. Let's keep our laser blaster out just in case we can blast rocks. Oh, look at that. Let's go investigate. Hello? Yes, this is the relic. Is that what it says? Scrap metal. Can I, like, touch it? Oh! Oh, 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 I did something. Oh, this is bad. I didn't mean to do it. Oh, you're powered down. Oh, hello. Okay, you didn't like that. Can I, like, give you something? Like, have some rocks? No, I think I need to, like, 
put something in there. Okay, you can't hold down to shoot. Oh, look at you. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry, sorry. Apologies. Apologies. I was just out exploring. Wait, can I blast the relic? Probably a bad idea. Oh, no, you can't blast the relic. Wait a minute. Maybe I can. Like, how far does the blaster go? Oh, wait. So if I do this, it does nothing. Oh, what is that? That's a rock with eyes on it. Are you a creature? Are you just a, a pet rock? What are you... Hello? Can I... Oh, dig you up, maybe? Shovel? Okay, I think you're just... You're just a pet rock. We have a cave system over here. Can we get... Let's get through that. I wish I could hold down on the blaster to fire. Oh, hello. Captain, where are we? It's kind of dark in here, don't you think? Wait, who is that? Somebody who's been in here for a while, it looks like. Captain, look, this may be our chance at first contact. Oh, oh, watch me. I can handle the introductions. Greetings, inhabitant of the great planet. We are travelers from a... Oh, oh, you scared. You scared him? You scared him. Wait. I didn't mean to scare you. Oh, um, sorry, Captain. Oh, I know. Let me try some different language patterns programmed in my directory. Click, click, clicky, click. I don't think that's the one. Uh, beep, beep, boop, beep. No, not that one either. Bark, bark, grunt, grumble. Maybe not. Oh, no, barks. Suit, suit. Captain, I think I did something. Oh my, he's all covered in dirt. I wonder why this little one is all alone. Suit, suit, a garble suit, pop suit. Okay, so part of this language looks similar to what the relic was doing. Uh, I think it said something about suit. Wait, what does that mean? Hey, little guy, is your name suit? Or are you just covered in soot? Uh, soot, soot. Sigh. Oh, you're hungry. You're hungry? Oh, he looks pretty upset and very hungry. Who knows how long he has been here without very much food? What do you think, Captain? Should we help him? Yes, of course. We're so in sync already. What a team we make. Who knows? Maybe with a full belly, he can help us learn more about that relic, too. I'm sure. I don't have any food on me, though. We should start producing some food right away, but let's report back to Kaida first. She should have some more useful information to help you get started. Hang tight, Soot. We'll be back soon. Ah, uh, we do have something shiny here, though. Some scrap metal. So you got a... Oh, you have a cave painting or cave drawing with crayons of the relic. It looks like a portal. Totally a stargate. All right, well, that's what we needed. So let's head back. Oh, I wish we could run. There's no run button. No, that's the calendar. All right, yeah, we need to yeah report back. Oh, look at the Colossus. The ship looks great. And hopefully we can head up and uh, catch her. Oh, it's 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock, 9. It's night time. She might be on the bridge. Or coming down to eat somewhere. Oh, nope, still here working.
Captain, I heard you made an amazing discovery. CPU told me everything about the hidden cave and soot sleeping inside. It does open up a lot more questions, doesn't it? But I'm glad you have decided to prioritize helping Soot above all else. Since we don't know much about Soot or his diet, Chip suggested we bring him a couple different food options to start. Chip has updated your mission log with his food recommendations. If you need more materials to build planters, Pilot and I scanned the Great Planet and found new uncharted areas that are sure to be full of useful resources. I have programmed these new areas into your shuttlecraft, so feel free to start exploring. Okay, good luck, Captain. I will handle ship duties up here while you get to work. Great Planet Exploring available. You can now use your shuttlecraft to explore new areas on the Great Planet. Your shuttlecraft will save checkpoints as you explore. Oh, that sounds great. So we can grow. Uh, we need corn, soybeans, and food rations. We're just growing potatoes. Is the shop open? Robert, are you here? Oh, you're not. Shop is closed. But what do we have? Is this, uh... Oh, it's closed. I can't even... Oh, that's corn. That's definitely corn. Maybe this is soybeans? Food rations could be... Anything here. Alright, well, I guess that's gonna have to wait until tomorrow. And in fact, we're at over an hour. So that's gonna do it for this video. Uh, this game is a lot of fun already. Just, you know, a few minor things, like I wouldn't mind uh, being able to hold down when I'm using the blaster or being able to find crew easily. Uh, that would be a big help. But everything, the, the art style is great. I love the different take on the, the cozy life sim that we're in a spaceship. We can, like, go on away missions and go to the planet, to different areas on the planet. Uh, two active missions, and I believe there's other planets, at least from the Steam page, it looks like there will be other planets that you can visit as well. And day three, Tuesday, but yeah, this is great. Once again, this is just the demo and is available for you to download. Healthy living, and do you know you can replenish your energy by taking one of the medicine tonics? Just press right on yourself while holding an item to use it. These tonics can keep you working late if you need the extra boost. Just don't overdo it. I will, I will take out of my email. I got a tonic right out of my email. That's what the future holds. Look at that. They can just send stuff through the email. Uh, once again, this has been the demo for Little Known Galaxy. If you want to check it on out, I'll have a link in the description down below where you can do just that. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like and subscribe. And if you made it this far, thanks for watching.